Let's go, Jay. 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 Let's go,
it's good. Had a little bit of that competitive fire bubble up. It ended up that Travis finished with 201 cals. Noah finished 212. And they kind of went head to head. And then Jake went afterwards. He was off his muscle ups, I think, at the two minute mark. That was a PR for 30 muscle ups for time. Held what he needed to hold on the rower. Plan was to try to go unbroken on the muscle ups if he could. He got 26. Finished out with the last four reps pretty quick. And then hammer the row, stay steady and then save a little bit for that last minute exactly what he needed to do. He did like 26. Yeah. I like started like pausing. Exactly. I zoomed in right at the end. Yeah. And you get the roll over, hey. baby, and everybody Oh, but we cheer. forgot Noah didn't do the wall ball wide. Ah! Yes. I really wanted to go 30 unbroken. That's always been a goal, but I think the 200 wall ball factored in there. My arms just kind of got gassed at the end, but 26, that's a PR unbroken set and PR 30 muscle for time, so. Yeah, I think it was it was before that. It was like 150. 150. He and Noah were like very close to oh, each okay. other on the muscle ups. And, yeah. then, and he was, again, super impressive. I think it was two sets. It was like 23 and seven or something Man, crazy like impressive. that. Yeah, yeah. so so solid. And then he ended up rowing 200 cows. Yeah, so, so got one cow less than Travis. He <laughs> made the mistake, though, of knowing what Travis's time was and then trying to overpace at the beginning. Yeah. And I don't know if he, you know, where he was at, if he had the capacity to be able to get over that. But Kyle Ruth, who is his coach, was in his ear kind of saying, okay, we want to get to 200 so we have to he had 10 minutes essentially so he's like hold this pace for the first three minutes and then pick it up and pick it up but by the time he only he had three minutes left he just didn't have enough left in the tank because he overpaced the beginning he's like yeah. holding 1150 to try to recover when in reality i think he just would have been better off maybe 1215 or 1250 or something yeah. like that did you think top five top five yeah so i was expecting to make the game you're here are you feeling good for last chance or what yeah i mean i'm grateful because two years ago what they didn't have this opportunity so I'm grateful that I get a second chance, but at the same time, still disappointed. I came up short, and when we went back and looked, like I ended up being 1.4 seconds away from making the games. So it came down to less than two seconds, and that hurts, but also kind of, it's reassuring that I, I, like I'm right where I need to be. I'm in the mix, I belong with those guys. Just gotta put it all together, and that's sport, you know? You can do it all day in training, but if you can't do it out there, then you're not going to be on the big stage. So. I knew in the back of my head that we were doing this camp and Noah was coming to town, Julian, Travis, we were all going to do it, and I knew that would snap me back into it. So, yeah, I'm pumped. It's awesome. It's just what I need. And it's the, the perfect amount of confidence boost going into Last Chance, especially because we're doing it here and the Last Chance qualifier is here. So I'm using all the same equipment. I get to go when I want, put my music on, use my bar. So there's all these little advantages but then again everyone else that's doing it has the same advantages so but i'm excited yeah. it's gonna be fun we have good energy here it's harder than i expected are you okay no what happened Okay. Alexis finished her muscle ups just around the three minute mark. Yeah, my plan was five. I think she went five, 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 five. And I stuck to it until the end. I did four, one. Four, one to finish just at three minutes. Why? Why? You just didn't feel like finishing that last rep or? I, I don't know. I just kind of, I don't know. That like was so You got to cool. that last rep and you just thought maybe, maybe you wouldn't yeah. do it or? No, I was like, this isn't a good idea. Come down. And now I'm like, what? What were you doing? Ugh. You really thought you could have got it. I don't know. In the moment, I didn't. But now I'm like, uh -huh. but I feel like you always say that. And then she rode over 1,000 cows per hour for the whole thing and got, I think, 100 or 150. Do we have our number in here? Yeah, yeah 150. 150. And then afterwards, we talked to, I talked to Sarah and we tried to kind of create a muscle up strategy based on that. We started with sixes on the 30 seconds, which I said, if you could hold, puts you at sub 230, which I think would be extremely good. But if not in that last set, you then have a minute to get your neck six to get off at the same time. Yeah. And she held the six on the 30 seconds for her first three. Then she got a little bit late on the fourth set to get her to 24. And then on the top of the minute, she had started and I, she finished her muscle ups at 245, got on, held a similar 
Cal per hour pace to Alexis and then kind of picked it up at the end, which I told her and Alexis this is a huge advantage being able to see somebody do an yeah. unknown workout, have a score, go after it. So I thanked Alexis for doing that in training and also for the last chance. Uh, but it can just give you context for the scores and knowing that it's not like a straight up head to head comparison. For sure. And one of the things I'd say is I actually was more impressive with the ladies on the road than the guys. I mean, the guys were going fast. In their week? Uh, yeah. They weren't <laughs> as impressive as the girls. They were holding over 1,400 to finish the workout, 1,400 cows yeah. per hour yeah. for like the last almost minute and a half. I yeah. mean, that is just so fast, rolling for almost 10 minutes yeah. and then to be able to kick after 200 wall balls and 30 muscle ups. It's just super, super impressive how powerful and how enduring these high level ladies are now in the sport yes sir travis mayer here from the crossfit games hey alexis raptors <laughs> from the crossfit games and if you can't come to sunny alpharetta and train <laughs> and if you can't make it to sunny alpharetta then don't miss the next best thing become an athlete at training think tank dot com cool Thanks. All right. Well, that's day one. We got day two coming at you next, and then we'll have our full workout demos from week from day three, not week Woo! three. <laughs> it was a long ass camp. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching.